All right. Let me tell you a quick story. Okay, guys? You have your attention. It's a quick story. I'm going to turn the fire down a little bit. Oh, yeah. You got a low fire, you can turn down a little bit. Isn't that great? So, let me tell you a story. We live in a county of people who have a lot of things. We live in America, a country, the United States, in which we have a lot of freedoms. We went to Scotty for food recently, where we went and we collected food to help those who needed food. It was a good thing to do. It was a fun thing to do. But the best thing is you're making an impact in people's lives. One day a boy is walking along and he sees a friend who has dropped a toy. And the toy is falling just out of his reach. And you know, he probably could reach it if he had just about four or five more inches. He's that close, but he can't get it. One boy continues to walk on by. He goes, you know what? That's a real shame. I hope he figures out how to get his toy. Because I had to lose one of mine. Another boy walks by. It's like, have you tried harder? You probably should try harder. You know, if you try harder, you can probably get it. But then he, he walks on by. The third boy comes up and goes, how can I help? I tell you what, how about if we grab hands and I help you stretch out a little bit further? And together, they can stretch out and that boy gets the toy. Where did the toy fall? Don't worry about that one. <laughs> so, what's the difference of what just happened? The difference of what happened is, it's very easy to see someone else who's having trouble and say, oh, that's too bad. It's very easy to say, as, hey, you probably should just work hard. It's very easy to walk on by. But you boys are scouts. That's not what we do. Scouts help other people at all times. We think of ways to help. It's not a question of having a moment of, wow, that's just too bad. We put action behind it. We go out and we collect food for the needy. Sam Ray, who's here, not here tonight, I wish he was, I was going to present an Eagle Feather Award because truthfully, he exemplifies this to the nth degree. Sam took it upon himself to create a collection of jackets. Our pack helped with that collection of coats, hats, scarves, and gloves. He did it through school. He did it through his sports team. Sam saw that there are children in this county who are cold during this winter. It's easy for us to say, man, that's too bad. Gosh, I wish they had something to wear. Or, hey, maybe if their parents worked harder, they should get a jacket. That's not the scouting way. The scouting way is do what Sam did. He stands up and goes, you know what? I can make a difference, and I will make a difference. I will speak up and I'll tell my friends, you have extra jackets, bring them to me. He sends out an email to all of the kids at school, you have extra jackets, bring them to me. He comes to our pack and says, guys, we're scouts, bring them to me. And he brought hundreds of jackets. And let me tell you, every single child that got one of those jackets is a lot warmer, happier, and blessed because of his action, not just saying, that's too bad. So, we've got holidays coming up. You guys are going to get great gifts. You're going to have a good time. Hopefully, you're going to be very, very safe. But here's my one challenge to you. Remember, be thankful for what you have. Thank your parents for what they have been able to provide for you. And look out every single day for ways to help others. Because everyone deserves to be helped. At this point, I think we have Din 2 has our closing song. Then too, who's going to